What's up everybody, it's Host here again on our awesome Black Ops 3 gameplay video for you guys today and I'm here to talk to you guys about this time the assault rifles known in uh, Black Ops 3 so far. Now, if you guys did not see, I posted a video about this two days ago about all the SMGs. I didn't post the video yesterday because I was busy all day yesterday sadly, but yeah, <clears throat> so yeah, uh, two days ago, which would be Monday, I posted a video about all the SMGs that are currently known, I believe there's still a couple more that should be coming out that just aren't known yet. Um, and now we're going to do the Black Ops 3 um, assault rifles that are all known right now. And I, I believe there should be maybe one or two, I think, more uh, assault rifles to come maybe as well. Probably just one, maybe two, I don't know. Um, <clears throat> before we do get into this though, I do want to say this is Drifter's gameplay. Not taking credit for the gameplay, it's all his gameplay. Um, yeah, so let's get right into this. So let's start this off. So we have two, four, we have six known assault rifles. So I don't know if actually if there will be uh, any more assault rifles that will be brought in. Maybe maybe there'll be one more. Uh, if there is two, eight assault rifles would be a lot. I know there was five. <clears throat> there was yeah, there was five known SMGs. So I, I definitely know there'll be at least one, maybe two more that'll be brought in there. So. Maybe there'll be one more assault rifle that's brought in. I don't know. That's not really confirmed yet. Um, but yeah, so so far we have the uh, the first one would be the Man of War, which is a fully auto uh, assault rifle. Uh, that basically self-explanatory there. Uh, there are uh, there are a couple that I'll get more into, like the uh, the Shiva. I don't. Know. S it's it's spelled S H I E V A Shiva. It's, I don't know. It's a semi-automatic, so it's uh they're, it's very similar to the F A L. So it's you know you have to keep clicking, so it's gonna shoot one burst, and you have to keep shooting. Obviously, uh, a lot of people I I, I love the F A L in Black Ops too. Uh, they had that like you know where you can make it automatic, but you know. It was a good idea, but it just kind of took the concept out of it, I think. Uh, but yeah, so the, the FAA I loved. I, I've loved that in uh, Monolith for 2. I've loved it in uh, Black Ops 2. Uh, I just, I, I like the FAL in general. Uh, some, some games bring out this, you know, the single shots, but they're not very good. But the FAL always seems to be very good. Um, <clears throat> so I would definitely, you know, most likely use that for sure. Hopefully it'll be good and not way underpowered. But yeah, so the next one we have is the Iraq. It, a R A K Iraq. That's what I'm gonna call it. Uh, it's also another fully auto assault rifle. Uh, pretty self-explanatory there. And then the Arc 7 is the next one we have. The Arc 7 is also fully auto. And a lot of you guys have probably already seen a lot of gameplay of the Arc 7. And Arc the Arc 7 was one of the favored guns in all the beta gameplays with all of the videos that were up. A lot of people were using the Arc 7, so it, it was definitely one of the favorite assault rifles. Hopefully this game won't be you know one-sided with a couple favorited guns that you know dominate over them This gun was definitely favorited, but in the beta gameplays It didn't look like it absolutely dominated over every single gun like you know advanced warfare does with the bow or the asm1 Or you know all the other guns all the other games usually have that hopefully it's not gonna be like that um, Next one we have is the XR2 which is actually a burst assault rifle So it'll be shooting I believe three round burst. Uh, I don't think it shoots a four round, but I think it just shoots three round burst. Um, I'm trying to think. This one compared to the uh, they don't uh, what was it? It was compared to the M16, I believe it was from I don't remember which. I think they were saying from Modern Warfare 2, I believe. Uh, I think that's what it was. But it was they were actually it might have been Modern Warfare 1. I, I don't know. They were comparing it to the M16, which like the the, the M16 version that was good because. I know Modern Warfare 2 at the M16 was very, very good. A lot of people actually didn't use it, but I, I used it, and some people actually did use it, I guess. But it was actually very, very good in uh, Modern Warfare 2, and I believe in Modern Warfare 1 it was actually a very good gun as well. M16 was good, and in the beta gameplay that I've seen so far, the XR2 seemed to resemble that as well, being very good and not underpowered, like, you know, some... 3 on burst guns have been some past Call of Duty's how it's been. I, I mean, I like the 3 on burst guns, but a lot of times they make it very, very underpowered, which is not really cool because, you know, you, you like to, you know, mess around with different guns and different kind of burst fires instead of just using always an auto, like, like I guess a fully auto uh, gun. Uh, and then the last confirmed assault rifle we have here is the HVK-30, which is also just a fully auto. So to recap here, we have two, we have four fully autos, a uh, semi-auto resembles the FAL, and a uh, three-round burst, I believe, which is the XR-2, which resembles the M-16. So a uh, good, good, I guess, uh, sort of guns. Like I said before, I do not know if they're going to be bringing out another one, maybe two. I, I don't see them bringing out two more. Um... Maybe they'll bring out one more. Maybe they won't even bring out any at all. I don't know. This is just a confirmed list so far that we have of all the guns. So, like I said, this these are confirmed guns. So these guns that I've been saying will be in the game, but we do not know if there will be any more or if this is just going to be for each of these guns. Um, 
But yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like I said, I did post up a video about the SMGs. If you want to, if you want to see all that list of the SMGs, go check out that video as well. But other than that, hope you guys enjoy the video. Please comment right and subscribe, guys, and also go follow my Twitch stream as well. I'm gonna be doing a lot of live streaming. I'm trying to get to live streaming, trying to get a little bit bigger in live streaming. So hopefully, you guys on YouTube who are big fans of me can also help me out on Twitch as well and watch me and get even more game, more content of me if you guys want more. So. Once again, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, guys, if you did. And other than that, I will see you guys next time.